Okay, so this is Crestwin Uke's introduction class review, day number two. And uh, last time we kind of assumed that we could hold the ukulele, we could tune the ukulele. And we kind of knew the parts of the ukulele. And then we started with a two chord song with the hokey pokey in the key of C. And the two chords were C and G7. And the way we approached learning that song was basically four, four parts. We sang the song, we sang the song, and I would do, play a little, sing along when we sang the song, making one stroke on the changes. We sang the song and played straight down beats, and then we sang the song, we played down up strokes. I guess we did it five ways, and the fifth way was we did down up, down up strokes. All right, so let's review this together. The hokey pokey, singing the song. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Those are where the changes are. Now we'll do it with straight down stroke. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Then we're going to do the next step is down, up, down with your fingernail, up with your pad of your index finger. You, you put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. And now we're going to do down, up, down, up stroke. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself about. That's what it's all us about. Okay, so that's our singing it, doing our changes, doing our down strokes, doing our down up strokes, and doing our down up, down up strokes. And we did that all on the hokey pokey. So let's look at it if we were going to play Row, Row, Row Your Boat in the key of C. The chords are going to be C. We'll look at the at the words there, C, and a G7, okay, and a C. Well, those are exactly the same chords, and this one is almost all C, except the last line is goes to that G7. Uh, life is but a dream. So the song goes, row, row, row your, row, 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 row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. And if we just play the changes, we're going to go to C. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. So the only time this changes is on the last line when they go G7. Life is but a dream. C. So that we've done singing it, we've done played the changes, now we're going to play down strokes. So it's row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 
Life is, life is but a dream, sorry. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. And if we do that down, up, down, up. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. And down, up, down, up would be... Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. All right, so that's how I'm thinking about learning a new song, doing new parts to it. And if we did the same song, same ideas with the song London Bridge is Falling Down, let's think that's it got two chords in it, C and G7, and we would try to figure this one out by going, by singing it. Lon London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. That's how I hear it, and if we just play the changes, it's going to be, we're going to play C. London Bridge is falling down, second falling down, G7, falling down, C, falling down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady, my, my fair lady. So the changes one more time, London Bridge is falling down. Falling down, falling down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. And downstrokes is London Bridge is falling down. No, it's downstrokes. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. Down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Down, up, down, up goes London Bridge. Down, up, down, up. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down. My fair lady, build it up with silver and gold, silver and gold, silver and gold, build it up with silver and gold, my fair lady. All right, so that's another little piece we can do um, of learning a song that has, um, if we can sing it, and then we can look at the changes, we can play the changes, we can play it down, up, we can play it down, up, down, up. So let's work on one more little strum, one more variation of a strum, and then we'll move on to uh, our next set of things to, to do. So we have got that down, up, down, up, down, up, holding a C chord. And I'm going to call that a down, up, strum. And if we were to count them, they are all equal. One and down up if we play it down up down up it might go one and two and one and two and one and two and one and it's all the same and two and, and the swing stroke which I'm gonna call the swing stroke for us 
if you remember Lawrence Welk was such a swinging guy, and he always counted everything off. And a one, a two, a three, a four. And so that's going to give us that swing sound. So here is one, here's the straight sound, one and two and three, and, and this goes, the up is the uh, and the down strokes are on the number. So a one, a, a one, a two, a three, a four, a one, a two, a three, a four. So we've got the uh and the and the number a little closer together than straight time. Straight time, one and two and three and four and swing time, a one, a two, a three, a four, a one, a, excuse me, a one, a two, a three, a four, a one, a two, a three, a four. So that's kind of a subtle change um, from that, but it gives it a much more moving sound. So just for grins, practice that and then go back and play those three songs that we know where the chord changes are. Try them with a one, a two, a three, a four. You put your right foot in, you put a two foot out, you put your right foot in and a shake a two a shoe a one a one out the blue and you turn yourself around and that's what it's all about we can sing row 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 your boat that way a one a two a one a two a row 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 your boat gently down the stream a where So try that one with the swing beat or London Bridge is falling down. A one, a two, a London Bridge is falling down, a falling down, a falling down, the London Bridge is falling down, my fair. So that gives us one more strum and three little songs or any of the two chord songs that you can look at, you can play with that C and G7. So now the second day we worked on learning another chord, two chords. The first chord we're going to learn is the F chord. And the F chord sounds like this. it is played on the string closest to your nose at the second fret with your middle finger. Open on the third string. On the second string we're going to play our index finger. On the first fret, right behind the first fret, and leave the last, the last string open. And again our fingers are going to go right behind the fret, behind the second fret on the fourth string behind the first fret on this one, and we get a little curve to our fingers so that the other strings can sound nice and clean. Okay, F chord. Then the other chord that is the equivalent of the G7 chord is the C7 chord. And the C7 chord is your index finger at the first fret on the first string, the rest of them all open. So we would call that out zero, 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 0001 C7. So F 3010 zero, and C7. So while we're learning new chords, we're going to play eights. So let's play eight Fs and eight C7s. One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, C7. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
half. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, C seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you don't have to move your fingers very far. You're just, it's this finger, index finger, that makes the F and moves just right there to make the C7. The others you can leave fairly close to the fingerboard, so it's not hard to change. Let's do that on the fours. Four Fs and four C7. One, two, three, four. 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 One. All right, good. So those are two new chords. Now let's go back and play those. I'm going to have to get a battery here. Think about how we would play the hokey pokey in the key of F. So, the two chords would be Sorry. Sorry, I have to get a battery. The two chords would be F and C7. And before we were playing C and G7, they're going to sound, the changes are all going to happen at exactly the same place, and the um, it's just going to be at a different pitch. So let's go back and do the hokey pokey. We're going to start on an F chord, and our second chord is going to be the C7. All right. So singing it in F, you, 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 you can find the right pitch. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. With the, with the changes, you put your F right foot in you put your right foot out you put your right foot in and c7 shake it all about you do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around that's what it's all about that's where the changes are same places we're just changing different chords let's do it downstrokes put your right foot in you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about, you do the hokey pokey, and you turn yourself around, that's what it's all about, let's do it with down up strokes, You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Let's do it down up, down up. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey, and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. And let's do it with a swing beat. A one, a two, a three, a four. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Okay, so those are the hokey pokey in the key of F. Chords are F and C7. And we did our singing our changes, our downstrokes, down up, 
and our swing beat. Okay? This, just for grims, let's do Row Your Boat. In the key of F, chords are F and C7. And it goes row, 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 find the right pitch. Row, row, row your boat. Row, row. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Not really my key, but playing the changes. We're going to start on the F. Row, row, row your boat gently down the C7 string. No. Start on the F. Row, row, row your boat gently down the string. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. So there's only that real quick change to the five chord or the C7 chord. One more time, the changes. Row, L, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 C7. Life is but a F dream. Downstrokes. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Down, up, down, up. Down, no, down, up. Row, row, no. Row, row, row your boat gently down. I don't know what I'm doing. I think it's just row, 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 down, up, down, up. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that would be down up. So down up, down up would be row, row, down up, down. Swinging it would be a one, a two, a one, a two, a one, a two, a one. A row, a row, a row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life, life is but a dream. Okay, now you can go on and do that same thing for London Bridge, it falling down in the key of F. And we're going to end up working our way through singing it, working on playing the changes. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Didn't do that very good. I'm getting hurrying here, but to the point we go down, up, down, up. London Bridge is falling down, seeing down, F falling down. London Bridge is falling down, see my fair lady. Down, up, down, up. is falling down, falling down, falling down, London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady, and swing it be a one, a two, a one, a two, a one, a two, a one, a two, London Bridge is falling down, falling down. Falling down, a one, a two, three, a one, a one, and down, my face.
fair lady. So you can do that on all those songs. And this is for very beginners, but everybody else who's playing other songs, harder songs, that same thing works to kind of make that song your own. Here's a preview for next time. We're going to play, we're going to do this and maybe add one more strum. So practice on these. And then the next chords we're going to learn are the G chord and the D7 chord or the Hawaiian D7 chord. And we know the G7 chord looks like a little triangle. Zero, two, one, three. And we're going to change that triangle so it points the other direction. Open, index finger, third string, second fret, ring finger, third string, second string, third fret, and middle finger index middle finger is first string second fret so it's index ring middle make a triangle zero two three two so that's the g chord and on all these songs that will be exactly the same when we're playing in the key of c of c that starts all these songs we'll see when we play in the key of G, the two chords will be G and D7, and they'll start on the G, and every time that there's a change, we'll go to the D7 instead on these two chord songs. The D7 chord, Hawaiian D7 is what Jim Beloff calls it, but it is two fingers, Index finger at the second fret on the string closest to your nose. Open. Middle finger on the second fret, right behind the second fret of the second string. And the last string open. So, two, zero, two, zero. And when you make these chords, when you change between these two chords, you'll notice that these fingers to make the G chord, those fingers are, are on those two strings and you move both of those over to make that D7 chord. So G and D7. So you can look at those and we'll run through some things with these. Next time we will add a, another strum and then you can look at any two chord song um, and play, play them in all three of these keys. And next time we will um, work on, on just starting on the G chords and then we're going to work on a three chord song that's going to use uh, C, F, and G7. Um, all right, this is a little long, but the reviews I got from people said that they didn't mind going this slow. Um, and it's, I want to make this help you understand my way of thinking of, of playing is you have to be able to sing it. You have to be able to play the chords that are there and make those changes, practice those changes, and then play the changes, and then eventually try several different rhythms until you find the one that works for you in that song. All right, see you next time, day three. This is day two, signing out. Bye now.